What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea, girl. I am here today, and y'all will not see my face because I went live yesterday for 24 hours. And if y'all didn't, if y'all wasn't there, you can still watch it on my Twitch at twitch.tv slash royalties where I CEO. If y'all a little bored for today. But before we go any further, I just want y'all to know I appreciate y'all for tuning in the way you tune in, how you got to tune in. You dig what I'm saying? But in the meantime, in between time, we're going to get into this tea because y'all already know I got a family to feed. So, for one, Prashant may have a new man. And I think that Blueface is going to come Twitter fingering in a few. <clears throat> but in the meantime, in between time, he a little quiet right now. I think he might be asleep. Uh, but while we have peace on the internet... <laughs> Let's get into Krishan and her new man, girl. But we're going to react to her story first, okay? Because yesterday her sister got out. Shout out to her sister getting out because that's always cool. So, boom, she did the, uh, she was at the school vibing to the sexy red with the students in, at her brother's school or whatever. So, that was a vibe. Um, Look like sis, sis living for me. You know what I'm saying? It's giving she living to me. So PD is actually the one that reposted that as well. Um, and the song is Shake Your Dreads, Shake Your Dreads, Shake Your Dreads, okay? All right, this is her reuniting with her sister, her family, you know, all that. Now, last night, uh, I don't know if this is New York, which I feel like it's New York, but of course she don't have no sound to it. She is still in the studio though, putting that work in, hello. All right, this is New York, girl. She's reminiscing, she wanna go back. Now, this guy is missing a tooth. He said, Krishan, you are not alone. Okay. Uh, thank you, Jesus. Shout out to him every day. Now, this is her taking up for Petey. <laughs> she was telling Petey to get his shit together. Get the oh, hell no. Oh, yeah. Hey. <laughs> now, with this, she said, Petey, we got this. Uh, I got you forever. Thanks for being my baby brother. I love you. Uh, I love cheering you on. She supports her brother 110%. And to be honest with you, I'm glad that he currently has a support system from her, bro. Because y'all know Petey, well, they didn't really have a support system, you know? Uh, the more these sisters talk, the more I realize that their mom was not there at all. And then the cycle continued because they weren't there for their own children. Uh, China been locked up. The, the other sister get just got out. The brother locked up. Like, oh, it's just a it's just a never in a cycle, man. But um, at least she can be there for somebody and for Junior, of course. All right. So I don't know who this little baby is, but he's cute. Yo, 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 yo. So Krishan go to the crib saying nothing in the refrigerator. So she says she going to go fill it up. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got this. Oh, let's go to the market. Let's we all gang. We all gang. <laughs> let's go to the market. <laughs> she made sure she fed them. Now, Krishan gave out her um, respects to a few ladies on her story, okay? Uh, Ruby, oh, no, ma'am, that's not what we're doing. <laughs> Ruby Rose, Glorilla, Ice Spice, uh, DJ Sky. She's still cool with DJ Sky, I guess. Um, now, I don't know what this is. Uh, Girl. Oh, what's Marsh? Okay. Uh Cardi B. <clears throat> Tamar Braxton. All right. Stunner Girl. Lola Brooke. Hello. Cause this song is fire. Y'all make sure y'all check that song out. It's called You. Um Scarlip. Okay. And then she got to speak in her piece. Before we get into her speaking her piece. Uh, Krishan said something about her having a new team, basically, and um, uh, something about her getting videos taken down. Uh, now, she's speaking about her music because <clears throat> these artists want their money from their music, and I don't blame them. So if I start reacting to her songs and putting them on Patreon, y'all already know, it's because <clears throat> sis getting her coin. Now, I have not taken her songs and just posted it on the internet. I did my rightful reaction, but I don't know how they gonna feel about it, and quite frankly, uh, I will get the coin for this and delete the video, to be honest with you. And, uh, yeah, you probably just gonna get her reactions to her music videos on Patreon. So let's just let her finish. <clears throat> she said, fun fact, 
I dropped music for fun. I probably got two songs. I dropped on all platforms. Uh, I got somebody taking all the music off of all platforms because I never put them on there. My fans be doing that dumb ass shit. <laughs> okay. Um, I just dropped music on YouTube and I barely do that. But with this new team and label, finna tighten all that up for me. Okay. She said, now I'm more settled in with my new environment. I'm on a healthy schedule with my baby. I'm slowly checking off my to-do list before I start getting back, get, getting really back to it. That's why I haven't posted other flyers with different cities because I'm making sure my to-do list is checked off. Girl, I hate the way these people talk. I'm honestly surprised at myself when God gave me a son, it gave me, it gave more of a reason to show up in my purpose correctly. It's like, I want to, it's like, I want to make sure I'm doing this correctly, or I don't want to be a part of it at all. Then it's like, I personally love thriving for someone else other than myself. Since my son got, got here, I just want to be the best Krishan rock in all areas on the behalf of my son because I'm all he got that drives me to go way harder her fucking pronunciation is about to drive me to drinking do you hear me um this version of me I feel deeply in love with the old Krishan was too weak um I promise God gave me strength when he gave me a kid period I still want 12 kids so I got 11 more to go which is crazy we woke up amen all right this is her niece and her sister beautiful now it says jada chastity she kind of had me confused as in this one right here because i don't know if she's her daughter y'all let me know in the comments but she did call krishan her aunt but i i just don't understand why her name is jada chastity but maybe chastity named maybe chastity Named her daughter a junior too. <laughs> Maybe she made her a junior as well. <laughs> this shit is crazy. Okay. Uh, this is Krishan taking a, a photo with some little girl. All right. Um, let me see. It's a love. I don't know. It's a love hole. I guess relationship with Krishan. Hot girl. She remind me so much of myself. Literally just got out of the same ish. We be lost for real. Showing genuine love to a motherfucker that only uh, see us as a dollar sign. People always see your light before you. Don't let nobody use and abuse you, baby. Period. Uh, Krishana's letting everybody know that she is on TikTok. Okay, 1.4 million. Uh, she's in the Bible per use. And this is her new man. Now, what I really wanted to say about this is, uh, this brother definitely resembles my face. I'm not gonna lie. When I seen him, I said, no, this bitch not FaceTime and blue. I know she ain't FaceTime and blue. So I guess she isn't FaceTime and blue girl, but give me a second. Let me do something real quick. So obviously she's not FaceTime and blue. This is another man, but it's giving my man, my man, my man. Okay. Now, first of all, she said that, um, who else loves a ninja with dimples? Okay. Now I don't like niggas at all. Okay. So I don't necessarily notice the dimples and I will say not too many women have dimples. That's the craziest thing. <laughs> not too many women have dimples. However, comma, uh, the point is, Krishan is showing her new man. Now, I want to know what y'all think about her new man, girl. She said that she like a man with dimples, and clearly she like a man that is the same damn complexion as Blueface, okay? <laughs> now, I think that he's handsome from what I see. She also had a couple things to tweet. Obviously, I done put up the wrong tweet because that ain't it. Give me a damn second. Because remember, y'all, I'm new, not true. All right, we working on it. We working on a couple things. But these are her tweets today. She said, and I quote, I swear I low-key went back to my tomboy shit to just avoid other people falling interest. Then I got a son. 
I'm his mom and his dad. So it's like I kind of turned off the affectionate girly me. I want to be strong for us. So bad that I forgot about being a bitch. And that's that have real emotions. Okay. First of all, I love that Krishan is cutting off the emotions, baby, because she need to. Some people, like some people, I was wondering why some people just stop drinking solely. Like, fuck this shit, I'm not drinking. But it's because they can't handle it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't handle having one drink because, bitch, I'm going to want to have 100. Meanwhile, I can cut off liquor today, pick it up next week. I can smoke today, pick it up in two months. I don't necessarily need it. I do it when I feel like it, you know? So it's time for her to cut off those emotions. And sometimes you got to be a little stiff. Now, that doesn't mean don't let the new person in. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely let that person in. And I hope she does. But I'm just saying, like, if she cut it off, maybe she'll open, you know, have more space for herself. You know what I'm saying? Because she's still in the process of learning herself. And um, I think that would be perfect for her. But the tweet before that, she said, I'm going to let my guard down for you. I just want to see how long that will last. I'd be so scared to accept new, like I'm obsessed and so clingy. And she is. And, you know, I love that she knows that. You know what I'm saying? Um, but it is somebody out there for her. It's somebody out there for everybody, y'all. You know, and I think that this, this guy may have patience with her. He may have some grace. Uh, and the only reason why I would say that is because he got to know her. I mean, hell, I know her. <laughs> Y'all know her. So you would think that he would know what he's about to get into is what I mean. So I just want to know what y'all think down in the comment section below, girl. I had to get a little serious on this one because Rashawn bringing out new men and shit. You know what I'm saying? She bringing out new men, y'all. What do y'all think down in the comment section below? Do you think this is going to last? Do you think Buddy cute? Do you think he resembles Blueface? Do you think she want him because he kind of resembles Blueface? I want to know what y'all thinking. And also, who the hell is this man? <laughs> That's next. Y'all got to find who he is, and then we got to figure that out from there. Okay? But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.